Hi viewers, welcome to learn MATLAB Simpling Basic. Uh, today we are going to see about how to use phase or measurement unit in MATLAB. So just I am going to click Simpling Browser. Uh, here you can go to uh, that mean uh, Simscape and then you go to in Simscape you go to Power System and then here you can see that uh, in Power System you have a specialized technology. Okay. And then here you can use uh, uh, that you click control measurement and click measurements right here you can see that the PMU right face or uh, measurement unit okay just you to take this block here and then uh, in order to see the results from the PMU so here I'm going to click electrical source and then I'm going to take three phase sources and then Next, I am going to select elements. In this, uh, I am going to select uh, three phase RLC load, and uh, I am going to use measurement block. Right, just go to click measurements, and here you can use three phase measurement block. Right, and just you have to connect ABC, and then connect ABC here. So and then just you have to connect the VABC output to PMU and just you change the basic detail here uh, the line to line voltage is 25 kilo volt uh, frequency is 60 hertz okay so here I am going to change the line to line voltage is 25 <coughs> kilo volt 60 hertz I am going to make uh, uh, inductive direct capacitor active power equal to zero and then here we can measure you can just you have to click this pmu right uh, here i am taken nominal frequency is 60 and the sampling rate we are using 64 points per cycle okay and then i am going to measure the detail of pmu just you go to type scope and then here we want to measure three parameter so and then just you have to connect the output of PMU here and then go to scope click configuration property and change to layout 3 so everything is set up here now we need to measure the detail that means uh, in PMU right phase or measurement unit you can measure the magnitude the phase angle and frequency of that voltage source or current right so first you have to measure uh, the, the magnitude of uh, voltage phase angle of that voltage and the frequency here <coughs> I am going to fix phase to phase that means line to line voltage measurement and I am going to simulate this model ok so here you can see that uh, uh, we are getting voltage magnitude is around uh, around 3.5 into 10 power 4 uh, that means we are getting magnitude means we are getting a uh, peak value right and then here uh, the phase angle is around 30 degree and then frequency here you can see that we are getting only 60 hertz because the source uh, frequency is 50 hertz okay next time I'm going to so test the model uh, that means I'm going to change the input right mm, for that PME to current right next time I'm going to check the result so here you can see, uh, see that the current magnitude right we are getting around uh, 0.32 right 0.35 amps so this is a phase angle is almost zero and then frequency you can see that is maintained 60 hertz okay so next time I'm going to check the system with the fault condition okay so how the PMU work during fault whether it will be uh, that mean response from the PMU is going to be changed or not right so for that I'm going to use another element nothing but fault element so I'm going to create the fault in the system so I'm going to connect fault to plug in this simulating model uh, here I'm going to create the fault at the uh, 5 seconds and then it going to be prolonged up to 5 cycles ok 
so here we are created a triple line to ground fault okay so next you have to check the results uh, first you have to check the current results right here you can see the during fault condition right uh, the current is current peak go, goes around 3500 amps and then you can see the uh, variation the phase angle of uh, current and then you can see the variation of frequency right so during that fault you can see that it goes to 15 hertz okay same way we can check the detail for voltage also i am going to connect voltage here and then i am going to check the uh, detail right so during fault condition here you can see that voltage comes to zero and then phase angle uh, i have some variations right around minus 50 60 degree and then you can see the frequency rate uh, frequency of both that means uh, decrease and increasing frequency right it's around 59.5 hertz to uh, 60.5 hertz okay so this is variation of voltage uh, during the fault condition okay so pmu will measure the detail exactly uh, before fault during fault after fault also okay so this is working of uh, pmu phase and measurement unit so we can use this space and machine medium in it as per your application in MATLAB. Okay. Thank you. Thank you so much for watching your videos. Kindly subscribe our channel and also click bell icon for notification about upcoming new videos. Thank you. Thank you so much. Bye bye.